Hey guys, so today I have Theodore's Christmas cage tour, and I've tried to do this video like 50 times, but iMovie just hasn't been working, it's been really annoying, so I'm just going to try using the regular camera, and so yeah, hopefully this goes smoothly since I can't edit it or anything. But anyways, this year we decided to get in the Christmas spirit and decorate Theodore's cage for Christmas, and I think it looks pretty cool. So, uh, yeah, I'll give you a quick overview, just of what we did. Um, it's kind of hard to see because of the glare and everything. It's quite late at night, but there it is. So I'll give you a tour right now. Okay, so starting down here on the shelving part, we have all these lights. If it will focus, I doubt it will. But we just have different colored lights, and the plug-in is right there. So you guys can see. And I think they look pretty cool and they bring out their cage or they bring out his cage pretty well. And then up here, I just added this. This year I decided to do a colorful themed Christmas. So I added this cute little space pod. I mean it has a little Santa on top. And if I just move this, I will actually show you the inside of it. Inside is actually just tissue paper. So he can shred it up and do as he wishes with it and have the little Santa on top and it has a cute little bell. And then in the back we just have this stopper um, just in case I ever needed to use it. I don't really have a reason to why it's there. And then we have this plush little Santa and he just sits right here and it's very cute. Um, and then we have some more lights. Again they kind of carry out a little over here. And um, we actually have some little tinsel and it kind of goes all the way through the cage. And then we go to this section of the cage. And I'll just go ahead and open it up and show you guys. So the bedding in the whole entire part of his cage is Aspen. And he has this cute little uh, um, guitar chew. It's made of wood. And then he has a cute little, uh, not cute, this isn't that cute, but um, just a toilet paper tube that he can chew on and go through and a mineral lick and then he also has some puzzle playground things which I'm so proud that I actually built this without it breaking apart because I'm very clumsy when it comes to the puzzle playground things and then moving over here we have this cute little Christmassy decoration over here we have a cute little um, Snoopy slow snow globe as you guys can see it's pretty cute and then we have this little wooden Santa and a wooden Rudolph, which is so cute. And this cute little um, stuffed snowman, which just kind of sits right there. And then we have his water bottle. And the lights do carry out in the back. And we have some more tinsel or garland or whatever you call it. And then we have some more right here. I'm going to have to move it to show you this part of the cage. Which gets a little annoying, um, so yeah, let me just move it a little, it's just so I can take off this top part without it, like, all falling in. Anyway, so now I will give you a tour. So, starting over here, he has his purple igloo with a little salt lick, just kind of sits on top. And then he has his food dish, which, if I can get it out just has um just this seed mix. There was a pellet in here, but I guess he's eaten it all. And then he has just a pink little chew block and his sand bath, which um, I just decided to use a little bit of the sand I had left. And there he is. Curious as ever. And then over here we have this cute little colorful uh, TV, and I thought that was pretty cute. And he can crawl in through the back which is adorable. And then lastly, we just have his wheel, which he really likes running on, and um, a puzzle playground shoe right there. So I'm going to go ahead and put this part back on before I move on. And yep. And just goes on like that. And then that drapes over the top. And then lastly, moving over here, we have this cute little um, snowflake ornament. 
and it just hangs right there on a ribbon. And then we have his water bottle. This is the Super Pet Blue water bottle. And um, the very last thing is just this um, reef, which just hangs right there. And it is pretty cute. So I'll give you one last overview of the cage. I think it's pretty cute. It definitely gets in the Christmas spirit. Um, and I really like it. And yes, I only leave the lights on for the video. I do take it off because, you know, I don't, I do like turn it off because I don't want anything to overheat or anything. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this cage tour. Please give us a thumbs up if you guys liked it. Um, comment, rate, subscribe, and please request. And I do want to thank you guys, um, because there were some people who left some really nice comments on the Rest in Peace Hamsty video, and that really brightened my day. So thank you guys so much, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!